Hey guys, Rilk here. Welcome back to my Final Fantasy X Let's Play. This is part 79, I think. Um, so I farmed up some pennant shields for a few characters. Uh, I got one for Titus, Waka, Oren, uh, as well as Lulu and Yuna. I haven't decided on who I'm going to use. Um, but now we have the options, at least. Let's try with this, these three. Um, somebody needs to use Dispel, so I wanted kind of Yuna or Lulu to get on the team. So I read the strategy. I have a rough idea on what we need to do. Uh, I am going to leave times four um, on, because it's going to be a long, long fight. I think he's got like 15 million health or something. <sighs> so, um, right, I wanted to save. I don't know why I talked to him. And he should be somewhere out here. I think he comes here after we've done all the Dark Aeons, which we did already. I'm not 100% sure where he is, though. I thought he was somewhere, like, in the crevasse on the end. Hmm. I might have to look that up. Alright, you can only go down there after you win the Chocobo Hive, but I don't have to do that again. I know someone was talking about this. Oh, that person. Let's go talk to them and see. Maybe there's someone we're supposed to talk to about it. Nope. Okay, I'm just going to take a quick look where it is. Um, I was pretty sure it was common lens. Sorry, this whole thing is like, where do you do it? Um, not where. Um, like, where do you get set up? What are you doing? It's not saying where I fight him. Let me see here. It's definitely a picture of um, the Comlands. Penance will spawn in the Comlands after you defeat all eight Dark Aeons uh, that spawn across Spira. Penance is appearing in the northern section of the Comlands. Did I miss one of the Dark Aeons? <laughs> This is in the calm lines. Oh, mm. I don't think this was not what like the picture looked like, anyways. Uh, huh. Okay, let's go through the aeon list and through my head. Bale four, we did. For it, we did. Ixion, we did. Shiva, we did. Bahamut, we did. Anima, we did. Yojimbo we did, and these three we did in one fight, so we should have done all of them, as far as I'm concerned. We beat all of them eventually. Bahamut took multiple tries. Um, hmm. I don't see him floating nowhere. I can't really change the camera angle. I feel like the fight's right where that lady is, where I was talking. Hmm. Let me just double check. I'm gonna Google it. Just because all it says is where he'll appear. Okay, Dark Aeons. I don't remember not fighting one of them. 
Balefor was Besaid. Uh, Ifrit was um, Binkanel. Ixion was the Thunder Plains. Dark Shiva was Makalania Temple. Bahamut was uh, Xanarkin. Anima was um, the Mountain. Uh, I can't remember. Gagazette. Uh, Yojimbo was in the same spot. And then the Dark Mega Sisters was um, just by Mushroom Rock. Okay. Penance is the most powerful uh, super boss in blah blah blah. Located in the Comlands, but fought on the deck of the airship. supposed to kill you Jimbo five times I didn't remember that slash it didn't say it in the guide I was reading okay okay he killed me a few times last time didn't he don't even remember I guess we should switch up uh, armors I did forget you needed to do it five times. I remember last time when I was setting up for it, I did it a bunch. Uh, but it was mostly to farm armors off of him. And maybe I just overlooked that part. are good or bad. Oh, I should have put auto haste on her armor. I forgot about that. It's on her new armor, which is why I forgot about it. I figure if he does like a good strong AoE, it won't kill Yuna, and she can resurrect everyone. It's basically my plan. what the holy ring is. Break HP and ribbon. Damn. Okay. It's like I got one before. <laughs> do I have to find him in different areas or do I have to leave the area and come back? I think I have to leave and come back. Maybe not. I might have to fight him four more times right here. I need to push him around a bit. I must have been really unlucky for him to kill me. Uh, I think he killed me a few times too. Oh, he got me. He would have got me there. Oh, he does it again. Maybe I wasn't so unlucky.
just in case we don't run into a heal. when he gets in the mood, it's all he does. <laughs> he might actually kill you now with the next one. No. Okay, good. Oh my god. I hate to do this, but... He's wiping the floor with me half the time. Alright, one more. Was that non man push? I'm starting to think one of the main reasons people don't like using break HP, um, the limit, isn't because it's hard to get. I think it's because they don't want to farm 400 freaking HP nodes. <laughs> Which, since I did a whole bunch anyways to finish off my sphere grid, it doesn't matter to me that much, I guess. the one we needed. I was debating whether or not I had to do Ixion again. I just felt like his wasn't done either because he kind of ran and was like, fight me again, bro.
gonna set everyone to comrade. Because I feel like we're gonna get dished out a lot of damage on us. Uh, we've got max X potions. Um, I have a decent amount of Phoenix Downs, which I'm hoping not to need. And uh, we have purifying salts that I want to use to slow him down a bit so he doesn't have haste on. Okay, we'll save right here. And uh, wish myself good luck, I guess. Oh my god. <laughs> Just let me through. Okay, we saw him. Where is he? Is he like hiding somewhere else? What is going on? Okay, they specifically said we had to do it on the airship, though. I don't know if that makes a difference. Let's go to the airship and see if we can just go on the top deck. Maybe that's where we fight them somehow. lady who was there, right? What is going on? Hmm. I don't know. All the suggestions are saying maybe you forgot a bit of kind of thing, but we got the cinematic and he's still not there. Maybe I'm just missing part of it. They're counting on Oh. Okay. I didn't realize nor yeah, nor did anyone say he becomes his own thing you run into off the airship. Um, and we also want to slow him down by hitting with a purifying salt. So let's target his arms. Thank you. Okay, well, with at least one down, I'll set someone up to start um, cheering. So the reason you're cheering isn't to up your damage, it's to... Oh. Um, so the reason you're cheering isn't to up your damage, it's to up your defense. Uh, where's Ooze? We want to hit him with something to get rid of his haste. And off the top of my head, I forgot. If I see it, I'll know it. But I can't. Okay, I remember what it's called as purifying salt, but why did I not notice it? I checked beforehand, we have like 30 of them. There we go. Okay, 
so that's two cheers. arms we're gonna have so much health we're gonna spend all of our time freaking taking up these arms fine okay so I also have to pay attention to my own statuses in case I need to use dispel on one of my characters to get rid of immolation which I think only starts halfway through the fight <sighs> I don't know if we're going to have enough potions. <laughs> Maybe the idea is only to knock out one arm so he can't use his AoE attack. Using quick hit on her because her MP it doesn't matter. I'm gonna just uh, worry about the arms when there's more than one. We'll see if we get AoE. And I don't mean this is skill, I mean like one shot. It's also supposed to take away MP, which is like terrible, but um, like Mac with like 999 MP, so it's like you beat zero. Oh my god, what happened to Titus? Titus. Um, let me reread this battle thing. Um, Uh, penance is made up of three different targets you can attack. The main body as well as two arms, right and left. Uh, they respawn uh, a few turns after you've defeated them and will continue to respawn throughout um, battle. Penance's strongest attack is called Judgment Day. The move will do uh, 99,999 damage plus 999 MP. He can only use this move if both its arms are alive. It makes it imperative that you continue to defeat the arms every time they respawn. Uh, main body will use obliteration, which is what we were getting hit by all the time. Inflict slow, but that doesn't matter. During the second phase, this move will be switched to immolation. Uh, the left arm will use a number of attacks during the fight if you leave it alive, including Sloga, Gravaga. Uh, the Gravaga will inflict darkness, doom, silence, and sleep, and similar attacks to Anima. Okay. The right arm will petrify and shatter them by removing them from uh, the fight. It will also uh, dispel positives. Okay, so we were supposed to take out both sets of arms, that's what was happening, but I don't understand what happened to Titus. Oh wait, right arm can petrify and shatter them, removing them from the fight. That must have been what happened. Battle strategy involves relying on your armor to keep your party members alive and strategically places attacks to take out 
the left and right arm when they spawn. I wonder if using magic would be better. Like, so I could actually hit all three targets at the same time with Lulu. And have your characters use quick hit every attack to ensure they get as many attacks as possible. This battle will take approximately half an hour to complete. Um, I feel like we came in a little unprepared for knowing how the fight worked. Um, honestly, I might want to just do another video just on the boss and then we'll switch up to just going and clearing um, Sin. And then I'll throw that in a video at the end maybe. I think that's what we're going to do. Sin's not a hard fight anyways. We're cow Here we go. Oh, I forgot we were going to have to walk the whole thing. <laughs> I knew we'd have to walk a little bit, but for some reason I thought after we got through the halfway point to, uh... Well, basically to the next section, I thought that's where we would land. Come on. What is it turning me around for? Sin time. It's been a long time since I fought Sin, so we might actually use some statuses that might do a bit. Um, and I kept Lulu with her penance armor because she doesn't have another set, so she's not immune to status effects. Maybe I'll swap out to um, we'll switch Lulu with Yuna, I think. Oh, she might still have. I don't know if I ever threw her penance armor on. No, I didn't. Perfect. Um, I haven't done this fight in a long time. I think our first fight's with, um, what's his face? Uh, Seymour. Somehow he got into sin here. Oh god. Forgot about this part. This reminds me of Final Fantasy VIII when you fight all those, uh, magicians. How'd you all get knocked over from like a hundred damage? Okay, so we gotta... I gotta turn the speed up off after that. We gotta grab that stupid egg that's floating by and I can't get hit by the icicles. Pretty sure that's what we're doing. bunch of times. I see the counter underneath me right now. It's 
nice without freaking uh, speed up. I can actually see stuff spawning underneath me. Really? Sorry, I just kind of want to see what the Kate Sith looks like. I don't know if we actually get to see it, do we? Unless I wear it. That was unfair. I couldn't move while it was uh, spawning. You cheated. Yeah. I don't know why, but the number 20 was coming in my head, but I guess not. It's good, because I didn't want to wait that long anyways. Trying to skip it. All oh, right, we gotta fight Braska. Not Braska. Um, checked as the Aeon. For some reason, I thought we had to fight Seymour first. Did I fight Seymour already? You're late. You got tall, but you're all bones. You eating right, boy? You've really grown. Yeah, but you're still bigger. <laughs> well, I am sin, you know. That's not funny. And this. Dad? Yeah. I hate you. <laughs> I know, I know. You know what you have to do. Yeah. can't hear the hymn so well anymore. Pretty soon I'm gonna be sin. Completely. I'm glad you're here now. One thing though. When it starts, I won't be myself anymore. I won't be able to hold myself back. 
I'm sorry. That's enough! Let's finish this, okay? You're right. Well then, let's go. I really like how his uh, animal looks, it's pretty badass. I don't 100% remember what the name of his Aeon is, though. No! Team Griever from uh, FMP. I promise this will be quick. Griever looks better though. Hit me with all you got, Dad. This will be quick. It's a uh, fight you can definitely do before stat lines. <laughs> it's gonna be like one shot and it's over. <laughs> it was over, but no overkill showed up. I guess maybe that was just part of the phase. Easy. That's a lot of health, though, from compared to before I stat max. It would take me a long time. How the sword's still there. a job to do, don't we? Good. That's right. You are my son, after all. You know, for the first time I'm glad to have you as my father. <laughs> so, Jack, no! Yuna! There's no time! You stay away! Yuna, you know what to do. The Aeons! We Aeons! 
Bahamas. Hey, it's Bahama. Call them. Call us. So I tried not to spoil it, but uh, Yu Yevon takes over Aeons, so we have to summon all of our Aeons and defeat them as well. Uh, I don't remember if I've spoiled that or not, but probably have. Yes. Here it comes! I didn't remember this part that we were gonna have this fight on the sword. I'm assuming this is gonna be the fight for all the Aeons. He doesn't make them any stronger if I remember correctly, but we'll see. Just, uh, the Maga sisters might be hard, we'll see. Hard is in relative, not hard is an actual hard fight. I think there will be one shots, but these are all definitely easier than the Dark Aeons, but I'm assuming that's where they got all the, uh, the skins from. I've already forgotten, does Bahamut really look any different? He must, right? I just don't remember. Slightly different, I guess. <laughs> I 
So what do we got? Anima, Yojimbo, Magasus is left. See what you got. Probably want channel three. Yippers. Easy peasy. I don't know what it was, but like they didn't look like they were tired or anything. They just kind of looked like they were sitting and chilling. called the uh, Skull Cathos. I can't remember. It's been so long since I played Ocarina of Time. Everyone, this is the last time we fight together. Okay? Yeah, huh? good call. Just throw everyone off just before a fight. What Perfect. I'm trying to say is, after we beat you, Yevon, I'll disappear. What are you talking about? I'm saying goodbye. Not now. I know it's selfish, but this is my story. Boom. Done and over. Can't remember if we fought Seymour earlier. Um, I was pretty sure he was before all the Aeon stuff. So I just don't remember. We must have fought him earlier. That or it's like a fabricated thing of knowledge in my head for no reason.
Oh, I guess we won. Well, the rest of it's just a wrap-up story. I think we're just going to end the video here. Um, thanks for watching, and uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Bye.